happen during the Western Conference Finals, not the regular season. Alrighty, we're already at the quarter way point. I'm going to basically keep this going until NBA Live 18 comes into existence and to see how it goes. Beat the Lake last game, lost the Clips, lost the Magic, so we're 2-2 two and two this month. And we got the uh, Nuggets, we're off to a 11-11 and 11 start, so a bit of a surprise there. Got a nice, favorable stretch here, you know, potentially. We've got the Nuggets, the Suns, the Nuggets again, the Knicks, and the Kings. So, let's see if we can put some uh, wins together before things get tougher, you know, around here. Let's get it done. Welcome to I'm not a huge presentation dude, but I, I like this. I like the opening, I like the halftime and post game for some reason. Northwest Division matchup. Between the Denver Knights gets the job done. The Minnesota Timberwolves. All right, as this game gets underway, what's the key to success for Minnesota tonight? No one fits any better to a system than All right, let's do it. Reed fits with the fast paced Denver Nuggets. Running rim to rim in transition, trying to block shots on the board. That, that was a case where the dreaded conceptual pass perfectly. If he was jumped up and bit, bit me that emphasized half court execution, he doesn't have a lot of skills to go to in that area. They're improving, yes, but that can be just as physical as defensive basketball. You've got to be willing to attack the rim and take Jeez. the body blows that come with it. And because they were willing to one overall pick but this kid, Carl Anthony Towns, seems like he can do All right, I'll take it. I like his versatility, Mike. Going to run end to end. He's going to think every rebound should be his. He's going to come and try to block shots. I love the tenor and tone he sets for his team. To the basket. Wig, ah, uh, blow the layup, wig. Free. Strong move to the rim. Goes to the goal. Good finish inside. Gallo doing some bully work in the paint. Moving the ball around beautifully. He dishes it. To the rim. <laughs> you need guys who can make shots. I hate that move for the CPU. Hate it. Use the fakes that you have at your disposal to create a angle. Whoa. The rim and then Someone needs to get over a screen better than that. Strong finish going to the rim. Curing the defensive rebound. Here they didn't do it. Good pursuit. Ah, all right, good hands. Stick it right back in. Get back, get back, get back, get back. Driving baseline. Adjusting on the wow, I actually missed a shot in the paint. That's the mark of a great limit for Andrew Wiggins because he is a special, special talent. Nice ball movement. Chandler from long oh, Jeez. Uh, well, if Wilson Chandler's going to hit threes, then we're just going to take an L because I'm going to keep on sagging off on him. You have that here tonight. This is one fascinating game. Wiggins against Augustine. Oh my God. Oh, look at the athletic. My goodness. Up. Nelson against Rubio. I cheated. Nice adjustment. He says no, but the ref says foul. Called against him. Cheated on the pick and roll. Jameer Nelson will get to shoot two free throws from the line. Man, I thought that was going to be an end one. Good strength just whipped out. First free throw, good. Throw shooting knocks down a pair. Boy, in playing such joy in finding the open teammate. And when a player plays with that level of double team, double team, double team. See how they don't leave people open who should be left open when they double. That's the big difference between this and the other game. 
Mm -hmm. his team does because he sets the tone. It's a lot harder to get a uncontested shot for a good shooter off a double because they're pretty smart of who they double off of. Teammates. Towns. That's just easy basket. Nelson against Rubio. Nelson from down. Yeah. Bang. Three pointer. Denver's three. Wiggins. Moves around the defense. Tough shot. Bates for two. Shot won't go. Moving the ball. Excellent teamwork. Ooh, ooh. It's a bit of a scramble. Let's get a T.O. From the field. Get organized. Denver's leading Minnesota by a score of 24 to 23. Reverses. All righty, Mr. Jokic. Perfect delivery. Average an 11.5. It's pretty damn good. Excellent ball movement. Great teamwork. Shoot it. Shoot it. I want him to shoot. Gallinari gets in the paint. Wow. Gallo's doing work, too. To Wiggins. Let's go Towns. On the inside. Ah, crap. What a dunk. I'm playing terrible defense this half. Terrible. Along with me is Jeff Van Gundy, Mike Green on hand. Minnesota's right there at halftime. Another close game, but certain things have to change in this second half for them to get the win. Well, sometimes there we go. you've got to have a team that can win in many different ways. And right now, the way to win this game is to do it defensively. All right, let's go. Stops in a row. He has the right type of game and attitude to improve at a rapid rate. And I think Denver made a wise selection in drafting. What in the world? See, that's a that's a case where the passing oh, that's a <laughs> failed me big time. Right Dunking the ball with strength. And Denver's leading Minnesota by a score of 34 to 31. Terrific ball movement. Adjusting in the air. Jeez. Fareed. And then finishing at the rim. Moving the ball around beautifully. All right, it's going to have to be the town show. Foul called against Fareed. That's his second foul. Because no one else is doing jack. Time tonight. That's good, sound, solid basketball right there. You go strong to the basket. You get fouled. And now you have a great free throw shooter shooting free throws. Able to convert on both free throws. Finish it off by contesting the shot. Sends it into the post, inside. No doubt about it, he hit him. It's called against Anthony Towns. That'll be his third, and finally he'll get a chance to go to the free throw line tonight. No easy baskets, particularly for bad free throw shooters. That's a good foul, smart foul. And gets both points from the line. Three. To Wiggins. There we go, Wig. Get Wig rolling a little bit. It'd be easier if he could shoot better, but hey. If I could isolate him against Gallo, I can take I like my chances. Fareed. Puts it up. Nice finish around the rim. Jokic is down there just killing me. Gets past the defender, beating him off the dribble. Sweet dish. Fires away. Jeez. That's pure talent right there. To beat. The screen is set. Oh. Execution. Solid screen. Good fundamental pass. Moving the ball. Excellent teamwork. 
There's the perfect pick. Curling in, knocks it down. We're just getting carved up. Playing no defense this game. Has to work harder to prevent the jump shot by the ball handler. He's got to get up with his man and either switch or show, but be more definitive. He's just hanging back in the lane. That's just not going to get it done. Needed that. Needed that one. The game. Quick move to get inside. No way, no way, no way. From down low, misses that one. You gotta figure out how you can get a better quality shot and use your greatness to attract the second defender and find the open man. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Back in his way down in the post. An effective drop. Let's go, Peck. Let's go. Good D. Look at Peck on the floor. Let's go. There's an exclamation point. Chandler. Oh, he's wide. Open. All right, Wilson Chandler wants to keep on busting threes. This is a bad shot than a bad player taking a good shot. To Chandler. He's got six points in this game. That's going to make my job a little bit more difficult. He's got three assists in the matchup. Here's the pick. Nice move. Let's go, Zach. And he puts it down. Oh, that's nice. No, 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 no. Not able to hit from downtown. Ah, oh, that's extremely unlucky. By a score of 53 to 50. Excellent ball movement. Great teamwork. Pass. That's more lucky. What was he thinking on that play? Who is he trying to pass? Okay. That's good. A one-point game. Wiggins. Drop steps toward the rim. Oh, that's like stealing. <laughs> that's like stealing. Towns on a friggin' point guard. All right, buckle up. Terrific ball movement. Jeez. Getting killed by Wilson Chandler. Kicks it out to the corner. Wiggins against Chandler. Ah. Not that time. Lock it. <sighs> that sucks. Heck of a rebound. Oh, shoot it. Let's go. Ah, oh, well. It's going to go like that sometimes. The final score is 57 to Not a very well played game. Gundy and our entire EA Sports crew. This is Mike Breen saying. Had some um, offensive issues. I couldn't really get anyone going consistently except for Towns. And defensively, we were just terrible. But, you know, it's a long season. You're going to have games like that from time to time. And it's time for the EA Sports post-game wrap-up. The Nuggets. Airs got a close victory in today's game. It was quite a display. I mean, God. And I can't imagine... The Shots like that are going in. With how it turned out. Guys like Wilson Chandler are, are stepping up and making threes. You see here is how the majority of the points were scored. For the You're going to take an L. Simple as that. The Timberwolves lost a tight one today, and you can see the disappointment. And while they didn't win the game, they could have won a dunk contest. They put down plenty of slams in this matchup. Check out the leading scores for the Minnesota Timberwolves. Game draft. Field goal percentage. Neither of these teams were able to make much of an impact on defense. As you can see here, they were each pretty successful with some efficient scoring. Let's check out the game stats. Player of the game.
Jokic was out here playing like friggin' Akeem. And here's the shot chart telling its own story. These are the top three plays of the game. Number three. Number two. Number one. We call it league scores. Check out the latest from around the association. Here's a view. Well, of here we go. We're standing. chilling at, you know, the four spot. Much better than I thought we'd be doing. So, you know, when I can't get anyone going but Towns, that's what the team looks like. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what the kind of, that's, those are the kind of games that I get. Sometimes I can get Wig and Levine rolling with Towns. Sometimes I can't. And when I can't, that's when we get our 10 losses so far. But we're doing pretty good. So looking at the old calendar again. Next up, we got the Suns, and we have the Nuggets again, and the Knicks, and then the Kings. So, you know, the schedule's still pretty um, favorable for us having a good week coming up. And, you know, hopefully we can... You know, pretty, do pretty well against the uh, Nets and the Celtics before we have the Spurs, Pacers, Spurs again, Jazz, and the Pistons. So the month of December closes out pretty hard. So I got to take advantage of these games coming up here. So hope you guys enjoy. Talk to you all later. Peace. And the Thunder are 8-15. My goodness, what's going on there?